Hey everyone, it's Sue. Good morning. Hey, today's edition of Framework 5 is about uh, less is more. And so where that fits in the framework is that uh, there's three major components to the framework. Creating strategies, creating alignment to those strategies, and then creating ownership for those strategies. So in the part of the pillar where we talk about creating strategies, less is more is a major concept. Balanced and less. Okay, so today we're really going to focus on the less. So what do we mean by less strategies? What we mean by that is maybe three to seven major strategies for the organization and then each of those being articulated into an actual measurable goal. Okay, so three to seven organizational goals aligned with three to seven overall strategies. Okay. And then when those are cascaded down or aligned down to the departmental level, then it's just two or three departmental goals, okay? So if you think about that, that's not a lot. And we did a, a focus group with leaders years ago and we had them bring with them their goals and a time study. And what on average we found was that they had 27 major goals each leader 27 goals for the year and only two hours a week that they can devote to making those improvements or achieving those goals, right? So you're gonna go millimeters towards lots of things or if you narrow the focus, you're gonna go miles towards the most important things. So when you use the concept of less is more, you have to really be thoughtful and strategize around what are the most important things and then have razor sharp focus, okay? So why do we do this? Because time is, you know, it, it's there's not an unlimited amount of it, right? And so if we have only so much time to give to our goals, to our major strategies, we need to razor in and so find out what are those most important things, declare those three to seven for the organization, two to three at the departmental level that are highly aligned with those three to seven organization priorities, okay? So the other thing that's really cool when you do that is when you narrow the focus, you actually expand your results. So sometimes when I'm working with organizations to declare, you know, what are these top three to seven strategies, you know, they'll have a hard time saying, well, how can we not do this? How can we not work on this? How can we not work on this? But what's really exciting about narrowing the focus on the three to seven most important things is that when you do that and you make huge, you know, strides in those three to seven most important things, then you'll get a ripple effect into other areas of your organization and operations. So for instance, you know, I have several examples where a department leader, you know, achieved one goal. They set one goal, they achieved that, they had wild success with that one goal, and when they did, seven other things improved in their department. So they didn't set goals for eight things, they set goals for that one thing, and when they improved it, that one thing was amazingly successful and seven other things improved, right? So it's amazing how this idea of narrowing in can allow you to expand your results. So go miles towards the most important things and then get this amazing ripple effect into other areas of improvement that you desire as well. So that's the excitement about this part of the framework is that Less is more, and when we narrow our focus, we expand our results. Now this can also play out in things like uh, teams and meetings. So each team, each project team, only having one, two, or three main goals that they're focusing on, maybe it's just one. Um, we were working with the nursing team and we were evaluating, because uh, they were struggling, we were evaluating why they were struggling so much. Well, they had this council that existed for years and years and years, and what they did is they had 20 major things that they wanted to improve through this council, okay? And so they would have two hour meetings once a month, and they would be able to spend only a few minutes on each of those 20 things. So they were going year after year feeling like they weren't accomplishing much because they were only mil making millimeters of progress towards 20 things. So our advice to them was pick the two or three most important things and put those on your agenda and nail those. And then when you do, pick the next two or three most important things. And it's amazing what happened to their team and their results and their impact in their organization. So less is more. When you narrow the focus, you can expand your results. It's a great tactic 
for a great organization. Have a great rest of your week, everyone. Bye now.